Happy Mother's Day. Good morning. Good morning. All the mothers out there, happy Mother's Day. Hope everybody is having a great day. Um, so we are here this morning to celebrate our mommy, the woman of God, Princess Delemcy. <coughs> We are doing this to honor her as a mother and to recognize her tireless efforts and her hard work and to appreciate the love she has shown us as her daughters in Christ. We just want to take this moment to say we love you so much, Mommy. Tell him I tell you. We love you, we love you, we love you. We have all been so blessed by you. We love and appreciate you. We hope that God continues to strengthen you in all that you do. May your light forever shine. And we we miss you. For me, I miss you so much. And personally, I love you and I appreciate you. And oh my God, I just can't start because it won't end. but we, we are here we are all here this morning to say happy mother's day and we love you and i also have chanel right here good morning everyone happy mother's day happy mother's day i'm so excited so we are here to honor our mommy our mother our evangelist our anointed woman of god oh we appreciate you i just want to say happy mother's day Thank you for everything you have been doing and you are doing for us. God, you know I miss you. Yes. <laughs> we miss you so much. We miss Happy you. Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day, Mama. We miss we miss you so so much. She wants you know. Um Andra and Christine, can you guys please comment? And um we have a special Ooh, guest that is going to start the show for us but before we invite our special guests who like Antra or Christine so please comment so we can all we can all come on as Princess Valency Ministry Angels and say a few words. Antra are you there? Happy Mother's Day Happy Mother's Day. Can we all tell our beautiful mommy Happy Mother's Day? Yeah, it's Mother's Day. Happy Mother's, Mother's Day. Day, mommy. We love you. And guess we what? We appreciate you. Oh, I miss you so much. She is not even here. She's, she's not here with us. That's the thing. I wish she was here with me. To give her a hug. She's in Europe having uh, a tour. Yes. And alone. And we are here, not with her. So we just wanted to take this time to say it. Uh, Even though she's far apart, she's way she's there. Yeah. Um, we are still here. We love her and want to uh, make her feel that we are there with her. We are still connected. And okay, I'm trying to bring you your camera now.
and I'm just trying to get Andra. Andra, can you comment again? Andra, Christine, can you guys please comment again so we can start the show? I guess all of you want to say Happy Mother's Day to our mommy. Um, I'm trying not to in a video sign. You no longer have a video sign. So, um, Shania, why we are waiting for Antra to come on? Why we are waiting for Antra and Christine to come on? Um, we just want to like go ahead because you know we work with her publicly. I mean, we know her more intimately. So, can you like say what has been like your greatest moment? Oh, what has like, like what has been your greatest moment with her as a mother to you? Like, just go ahead and say something. like every moment, every time spent with her is a great moment with our mommy every time spent with her like she's a mother uh, she, she she is a mother she will correct you you don't eat she's at home and she's asking how are you janelle did you eat today or did you do this did you go to your shop or are you okay is everything okay okay she will ask me every month that you, I know you didn't pay your rent, and my mother would pay my rent. She pays my rent every month. That's a mother. That's a mother. Apart from that, it's just too much. She cares. She prays for us. She loves us. She advises us. She just, here, get us here. <laughs> We go out, take us out to eat and all that. That's yeah. like a, a moment spent with her. Every moment spent with her is just incredible. And then some of those times when she says, like, one sitting with her is the next thing is preaching. Yeah. She has to preach to us. And then it's something that if it is like we started for, she said, let me just tell you something for like five minutes or so. We're going for almost two, three hours, four hours, five hours sitting there. And she's just preaching to us. That is just something that I can never let go of, and it's all moving okay, to the Okay, Antra, as Cindy, I'm going to bring you on camera now. Yeah, and I want to say, yes, that's just like it for me. I think, like, she's been different, like, she just been different. Hi! Happy, Happy Mother's Day, my God! Happy Mother's Day! I think she's gonna try again. That's all. So yeah, it was because it was because of um Antra. Is it better now? Can everyone hear me better? Is it better now? Um am I still echoing? Is it okay? No, it was because of Antra. 
okay it's better now they say it's better okay i think it was andra's phone and she's gonna go fix it so we're just gonna give them one more minute to see if they can fix the phone and come back on but as chanel was saying there's just so much like uncountable things for me i personally don't know where to start and working closer closely with her i've seen like her love for people like a really 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 true motherly love she's always concerned not only for us that works with her but for her followers entirely like doing a program she wants to make sure like um everybody have food to eat um we still make sure you get the best deals from the hotel for my followers um make sure everybody online sees things like um we still do you know if this person have transport how can we transport them how can we help how like just that motherly concern that is really like r-a-r-e-l-y really really seen in anyone and her concern for me like is just a like on another level she always asks me how's your husband how's your family do you need this um are you okay if we have a if we are having a program she's always making sure that in fact she even buys us hair like china do you remember um that was this time in houston she took us to the store and got <laughs> us three thousand worth of hair yeah. like three thousand usd just like um you guys and take took any us hair. And do our nails and all yes and took us and for me i always told her i've never done my nails in america because I'm always busy. <laughs> so she laughs. She's be like, um, we soon have done some nails when she was when she is with me. I'm like, okay, that's why you're my mommy. At least you take me to do my nails <laughs> and stuff. She will tell us to take two two hair. How yeah. many hairs you want? You sure you three thousand? Take hair, take uh -huh. hair. Mommy, we already got hair. We got this one. No, go ahead, take more. Are you take sure more. you don't want? <laughs> like, okay, our mommy said it. We're gonna do it. <laughs> And then like after the program she like take us out to eat like after this program remember when we went to um yeah. the african store Stash. she's like 600 take you guys you should eat. eat i mean there's just so so many things and i know personally for my birthday she went out for me i don't know how we can ever appreciate it like can you imagine like um the last program in Italy Germany she bought food for everyone Definitely. that's like a true mother. Yeah, and like, and another sure. thing she does is that when having a program in another state or mm -hmm. let's just say online and she always like online people can you hear me? This is not also for you, not just for us here, but also for the onlineers. You know, it's just like She's not just thinking about the people right there. She's thinking about other people, thinking about everyone that's watching. Isn't that like someone who just cares about, I don't know, it's just... Yeah, um, it's just so... We are just blessed to consider ourselves truly, truly blessed to know you. Um, Andrea, are you driving? If not, we're going to start thing. the show and fight our See, guests to start the show for us. See what she just did for me the other day. Um, um, I'm sitting, I'm sitting, and then she, um, I'm at the, I uh, went to DC and mm -hmm. she just, yeah, like, oh, mommy, I'm in DC. So she's like, um, do you have money? I didn't ask you for money, mommy. And she's like, I know you need mommy, uh, money. I was like, oh my God. Right away, I just saw a thousand dollars on my, my cash app. She said, send me your cash app when I, what was this two days ago yeah two days, two days ago. ago i just called to say hi mommy i miss you and i'm in dc and the next thing was do you have money and god knows i never have money and i actually tap into that because i received one because because you shared yes <laughs> no because you gave me 30, 31 dollars okay <coughs> you know, i needed 30 <laughs> well i still got my money i back. actually needed 31 dollars for uber mm -hmm. and then when you gave it to me that was like yeah that was good and yeah so she, she just, just goes way out and everything we just love her Anja, are you there now um oh we are about to start the show and oh somebody said i look beautiful thank you 
um momin tibora are you there with our special guest if you are there can you please comment our special guest Andrea, you don't have a video sign we're gonna go on and invite our guest thank you one more of god he said great job oh. yes mommy on your phone alcohol um mommy tibora are you there so what's the video Um, while we are waiting for mommy, how are you today, mommy? Mommy, are you there? I'm still looking for your comment. I'm looking, I'm looking. We love you. We love you, woman of God. We love you. More grace, mommy. We miss you. I can't wait to see you. God knows I'm going to hug you. <laughs> Just be careful. Waiting for mommy to come on with our special guest. Thank you, Dockers. Happy Mother's Day, also. Okay, our special guest is getting ready. The um, we just need a few moments, and I know some of my sisters also would like to come on. I know they have a word of two for the woman of God. So, can you ladies be pre please be prepared and prepare? Like, if we call you, please make sure you are properly attired, and it's just gonna be like. One minute. Um, mommy, I see you, but I'm not seeing the video sign. Okay, so I'm trying to edit the thing in the video. Is it better now? Um, is it better? I you guys I... say something. Hi. Hi. Yeah, I think it's I better. I think it's better now. Can you guys hear yeah, us online? Christine, can you dress closer to Andrea? Oh, I can almost have got say yeah, so it's, it's better now. So yeah, yeah. we have the full thing yeah. here. Yeah. And we're just going to shout out big. Happy Mother's Day! Happy Mother's Day! We love you! We love you so much! Well, I have a few things to say about the woman of God. And Go ahead. You've been more than a mother to me and my family. I mean, since we came across the woman of God, it's been blessings upon blessings, and we can't deny that fact. She has been so amazing. I remember one day I did something wrong with the video. A woman wasn't happy. She was chatting me up. Before you knew it, she was like, Andra, do you have money? <laughs> I was like, no. She's like, okay. I'm saying this is also not to you. I was like, oh my God. I was looking at myself. I'm like, what? Who does this? Like, <laughs> why? You, you have such a good heart. I've never met anyone like you. Like, your heart is just so pure. The way you care for us is on a different level. And 
we are just so blessed to work with you. As in, I can't even express how I feel. I couldn't even sleep throughout the night. As we see, we're all doing video call because we can just <laughs> want to tell how we feel from the bottom of our hearts. We love you so much. Please keep correcting us so that we can be better. Better. You know, yes, so. Set us, buy us wigs. You know, pay for our clothes. So, if you guys don't know, we sell for us. Buy us wigs. Everything, even her designer stuff, she gives it to us. Like, why? Give it to us. I just want to, I want to say good afternoon, woman of God. Christy baby. I love you so much. And um, I thank God that I met you. It wasn't by accident, but I know you're my destiny helper. And um, you've done a lot for me. When I came, I was uh, scattered and every other thing. You helped me to be um, a better person, and um, you helped us to grow in the ministry. Even when you shout, it's for us to get better and to do the work right. And um, you, you, are, you are very generous. You are very kind. You care about people a lot. You don't care whether they are rich or poor. You always want to draw people close to you. And... Um, the ministry is all about love, which represents your name, and you are showing that to everyone. We just want to say, on behalf, I want to say, I appreciate you and I love you so much for caring, for being always there for us. And um, even though the time you told us that, oh, God is leading me to get a um, house for someone, and in my mind, I said, <laughs> and I pray. And it's a house for poor people. My sisters, I don't know. So I kept on praying and believing. And you said, Well, my um, sister came like, Oh, I'm getting the house for you guys. We we're so happy. I was jumping. I was like, God, who does this? No way. I don't see anybody. You're so kind. You're so generous. I'm lost for work. I don't even know what to say. Over, over $20,000. Paid and paid for a year. If you guys don't know about it, you pay for a year. Who, I mean, who does that? And you guys, you see the way one of God gives out money mm -hmm. and prays for us spiritually. Yeah. We're so angelic. Yeah. You guys know what we go to, where we are. We have yeah. how, you know, we're always yeah. with the Holy Spirit, how our body is always hot. Yeah. And you tell us to come. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and that has anointing. <laughs> the anointed ladies. <laughs> They're blessed from here. Um, mom, mom of all generations. And we know that this this is small. We know that next year it will be massive. So something great and wonderful. We are shutting down the stage of our mother's day. Shutting it down completely. This means if you are not following this ministry, you are wrong. Go. This is the right yeah, ministry right. to be. You know. That's it. And then um, <laughs> like one great thing we have seen is how. Her influence on us have caused us and every one of our followers like to love God more. That is just priceless. Mm -hmm. Like um she's fulfilling her mission, not only as like a person, but also like um she's she is an evangelist, she is a woman of God, but she's also a mother. Mm -hmm. yeah. And and somehow she managed to like to show love in both ways. Like, she's great. She wants to do the will of God. Definitely. But she also has that motherly love. Like, that. Like, she's not just going to pray for you because she's a woman of God. Of course, she, I mean, she will pray for you, but she's also genuinely concerned. Like, really, really concerned. Like, oh, are you okay financially? Are you okay spiritually? Like, mm -hmm. physically, mentally, are you ready, ready, okay? So, mm -hmm. it's just been, like, me, I mean, like, all I can say is, God bless the road that led me to her, because it's just, like, blessings upon blessings upon blessings. And um, even a million of people or thousands of people watching all the time, it's not just us that's talking or saying that she's been of yeah. help to us. She actually been a help to a lot of people that have been watching and following mm -hmm. the ministry too, yeah. financially, spiritually, and uh, you know, emotionally and all that. 
she will call people, check up on them, not just mm -hmm. money. It's not mm -hmm. just not talking about money, but she will call you and check up on you sometimes when she even dream about you. She will tell you, oh, I had this dream about you and take this, uh, encourage you or lead you on a way to go, how to go along with it. So uh, apart from us helping us uh, financially and all that, or uh, her girls, I'm pretty sure she has been a blessing to uh, thousands of people that has been watching or that are watching here and can actually say that she has been like a motherly figure to them too as well. Because uh, some people will come up saying that um, I wasn't expecting her, but she just called me up and paid, she paid my rent. And apparently God just laid it in her heart to do this for them. So I think a thousand people, uh, people that's watching here can say that, yes, she has been a blessing and a mother to me. Some people that even lost their moms, you know, and she's always there for them. Do you guys know when she was crying for the witches? Yes. And she was thinking, yes. like, that was so touching. Yeah, just so I, she was praying that if God could <laughs> save their soul, yeah. to save them before, you know, like I sat down first because I was like, we are praying for witches to die. So why do you pray for it? Yeah, you know, so I was like, one minute I sat on like, okay, mommy, you the same person said we should pray for witches to die, but you hear crying again that innocent souls are dying because it's yeah. not them, it's the demon within them that is doing that and it's not them and you could feel that you could feel that feelings that she was so, feeling she asked like jesus so jesus has compassion that's what yeah. right woman of god when you see her you, you see jesus in her it's like oh my god like who is this woman she just acts very selflessly yes. she loves she pants and at the same time she scolds you she's she's a respecter of no man yeah. which is which is jesus jesus respects nobody she gives it to you the way it is if you mess up you mess up if if you if you're singing and you think that she's going to be petting you for singing my dear well, that's not the woman of god we know she's a mother she's mother you. Anytime she, she pats you on like back. this, that's the woman of God we know. So let's give other people to talk. Let's not take all the time. Rini, you want to say something? Yes. Yeah, so, so um, just so Hi, Rini. Hi. Hi. Look at Rini. Look at <laughs> I just want to say, I'm Mother Day, woman of God. I love you so much. You've been more than a mother to me. Um, I mean, I've. I've had the opportunity to see woman of God even outside, um, like gathering, even in our house. She's she's always spirit filled. She loves God, whether whether you want, whether anybody is there or not. She has touched my life in so many ways. Uh, she has made me to grow spiritually. Oh my God, woman of God! I don't know what to say right now. You really changed my life. <laughs> And if I say Happy Mother's Day, it's like it's just a small word, and I wish I could comprehend and say exactly how I feel because I want to say I love you so so much. Thank you for all that you've done. Love you, man of God. Kisses. Bye. Oh, yeah. Rini, please don't make us cry. <laughs> That's our mommy, man. She's a blessing to uh, thousands and thousands of people out there. Okay, Andra. Um. Can you guys? I'm gonna take you guys off now and invite mommy to bring in our special guest. Oh, no Bye, love you, woman of God, and everyone watching. Okay, okay Antra, can you go off? Wait, hold on. Yeah. We love you, oh, mommy. She said, "Love you guys." I'm just trying to add. Um, is it going? Yeah. Um, mommy, the phone is ringing. So we are here to appreciate and say Happy Mother's Day to Thank our mommy, Belima, I believe, mm -hmm. evangelist. Mm -hmm. 
our mommy who's always there for us so if you are just joining in yeah. we are here to say happy mother's day to our mommy eventually princess belemzi can you please comment again i called but no answer no answer We love you, mommy. Oh, I dreamt my brother last night again. <laughs> Don't you can't see what I say? network issues but it's gonna be on hopefully so, so while we're waiting for our guests to come on we can all go ahead and type like something we like about the woman of god or how she has influenced us or how she has influenced us personally as a mother and i know okay Hi, happy Mother's Day to all of you out there. All happy you beautiful Day, uh, granddaughters of mine. Yes, oh, mommy. love you all so much. We love Thank you. Thank you for what you're doing for your mama. Hey, <laughs> <laughs> Michael is here. Hi, Hi. Michael. Thank mm -hmm. you for being our special guest on this um, broadcast today. So, so can you go ahead and bless this um, broadcast for us and then also say a word or two to our special mother, the woman of God? Uh, okay. It's me, Michael. Father, we thank you. Wait, let me remove this uh, notification. It's blocking me. How do I remove it? Let me see. <laughs> How do I remove notification? Oh. Okay, let it be. It, it, it's not showing, right? When I have no, it's not showing. It's not showing on your part. Okay. No. Oh. Okay. Let's pray. Father, we thank you for this special day that you have given us. Father, we thank you for life. Without life, we cannot praise you. We thank you for the air that you breathe in, into our nostrils. We thank you for quickening our bones, for us to be able to get up. We thank you for the love and care you've given us. We thank you for blessing the fruit of our womb. Yes, blessing our womb to bear fruit, fruit that is going all around the world to be a blessing to others. Father, we thank you for the children, the people you brought into your daughter's life. Father, I thank you so much for making me a grandmother of multitude and my daughter a, a mother of multitude. Father, thank you for the grace. It's only your grace. It's only by your grace that we can do this. Father, we pray that this blessing is also given to those who are looking for the fruit of womb. We know that as you have blessed us, you've blessed every woman. Every woman is destined to be a mother. Father, we thank you. Not just a mother, but a responsible mother. And also blessings for children who can take care of their mothers, not just coming to the world and letting their mothers suffer. They should know the value of a mother. Thank you, Father. We bless you for giving us the spirit to thank you, to love one another. Father, may you increase us and change our ways to love you because you say we should love you and every other thing will fall in place. Thank you, Father, for loving us. Thank you, Father, for accepting our love. No matter how little we, we give, we know you are always faithful to us. Father, thank you. Give us the heart to love you more and to do more. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray. Amen. Amen. Um, thank you so much, okay. Mommy. Mm -hmm. Can we all just take a moment to celebrate Mommy by giving her a hand clap or something and telling her Happy Mother's Day? Happy Mother's Day, Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. I love you all so much. I love you. Know, but I really do love you all. And I pray for <laughs> all of you. I mean, without you, there will be no ministry without mm -hmm. you. So we thank you so much. So mm -hmm. now, why am I here today? 
<laughs> this yeah, is yeah, the day that I never thought. Mm-hmm. Yeah? You are here to celebrate with us, and we are here to celebrate you also. Okay. Now, how did I get here? That's the question. <laughs> how did I get here? Get here. It's a day I never thought, you know, <laughs> would happen to me. But okay. by God's grace, it has happened. Amen. Right? And yeah. for bringing you beautiful ladies into our lives. And it's all because of my fruit of the womb. Amen. A blessing to me and to so many. So I thank God. I don't know what I did to deserve it, but for some reason you found me worthy. So I'm so grateful. And this is a daughter that uh, we never thought would be this, even though it's been said long ago before she was conceived that she would be great. But we thought, you know, well, we just waited to see where the greatness would lead her. Eventually led her here. And we're so grateful that it's not just for personal thing, but is for a blessing to the nation. And he has made her a beautiful mother. Not just a mother, but a beautiful, responsible mother. The one who knows how to praise, who knows how to admonish, who, <laughs> who knows exactly what she wants, full of the spirit of God. She tells you to do something, she does it too. She will yeah. not just say, oh, you do this. Uh, I'm not doing it. I am the leader. I'm the teacher. I will not do it. But she she is exactly what she says. And there is no difference, both inside and out. You see what you get, what you're seeing. That's it. Nothing hidden, <clears throat> nothing from any other source, but straight from God. You know, so I'm grateful. She's not just only a good mother. She, she's a good daughter. She is a good daughter. She really does take care of her, mo- her mother, in fact, her family. She's a blessing, not just to us alone, but to the outside world, you know, to the children God has given her. And I thank her for making me a grandmother. Aww. <laughs> so all you beautiful ladies. Yes, she's also a very good mother. Her son is right here. I would like him to say something. But before then, let me say Happy Mother's Day to my beautiful, God-fearing daughter. Thank, Thank you, you, Mommy. For coming to my you life. Go. To our life. In Jesus' mind. <laughs> okay. Mommy. Before uh-huh. you go, we just want to say thank you for everything you have been doing for us and still doing for us. We appreciate you, especially when you cook our food. Yes. <laughs> you you <laughs> always remember you, mommy, us. Mommy. You, always remember us. Mm-hmm. you always remember us. You won't just make food for the woman of God, pastor or bishop, but you will always include our bowl. Mm-hmm. You know, so we appreciate you. That's our attitude of our mother too. So we thank you so much. We appreciate you. And we say happy Mother's Day. Thank you. I'm including you now so that you can work very hard, right? <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you to go hungry. Anyway, we thank God for that. We thank God okay. for that. That is the part that my role to play. And I'm so grateful that I'm able to do that. And I'm yeah. just praying for strength to do more. To do more. You are lovely you, ladies, mom. you know. Thank God for mm-hmm. for bringing you into us, uh, into our midst and to us, you know. Thank you all for taking Thank care you. of your woman of God. She can't do it all alone. Yeah. Without you, she can't exactly. do it all alone. And without the viewers out there, she can't do it. So I thank you all. I thank you all for loving her. I thank you all. And for loving me too. Thank you. <laughs> God thank bless you, you all. God Amen. bless you so much. <laughs> okay. Uh, one more clap for mommy. One more clap. Uh, <laughs> mommy, Michael. Uh-huh. Come this way. Come closer. Let him move closer to. Okay. All right, Michael. Hello. Uh, yeah. Michael, can Michael, you, you are too close bit? to the phone. Come this yeah. way. Come this way. Okay. Hold it. Hold it. Let him hold it. Okay. Good job. Hi, Hi Michael. Michael. A little bit. Hi, let them see. Don't touch the screen. Okay. Uh huh. Say hi to. Hi. Say happy Mother's Day to you. Hi, Michael. Say something to you. Uh, happy Mother's Day to my mother, 
Uh, the woman of God, evangelist, princess, Blumsy. Yeah. Okay. So, my mom, she's always told me that we've gone through so much together, which is true. Mm -hmm. And that... And that she loves me, which is true. I love her too. And I love that her ministry has come so far. And even though I'm not always there to travel with her, I'm proud of her. Very oh, proud of her. Oh, you make me want to cry. I'm, I'm always wanting to cry too. Okay. So, yeah. And, and she's done a lot of things to help her children and not just me but to all of her followers and since she has children children other than me that technically makes you guys my siblings oh yes we are <laughs> that's a good one <laughs> and we are proud of your siblings yeah okay to you miss mom so bad yeah, I miss her a lot. Uh, but we've been communicating and talking with each other. Yeah. All right. Yes. I thank you for doing what you're doing. And I know that my mom has blessed you. And may she continue to bless everything that you've done for her. Amen. Amen. And we also want to thank you, Michael, because um, we, we we know that we take a lot of time with your mom from you. Your mom is always out there blessing us, looking That's out fine. for thousands of followers, but as a child, you understand. So, yeah, thank you so much. It's a blessing to love you. We love you, we love woman you. of God. Oh God! I'm just, just good. Good. take care of yourself. We we can't wait to see you again. Yeah, we can't. <laughs> we wait. need you home. The house is very quiet. <laughs> yeah, I'm tired of being in my quiet place now. Yeah, <laughs> I'm tired. Come and shake quiet. it down. Shake it. Shake it. Bring down the roof. Yeah, okay? Michael. We are. <laughs> we miss we are you proud so much. You. <laughs> we are proud of you, Michael, and um, keep doing what you are doing and be encouraging your mom and being there for her, being understanding. We, uh, well, we are very proud of you. Thank you for everything and thank you for being my brother. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. All right, mommy. Thank, thank you so much for coming. Okay, so yeah, let's give it up call. for Michael. Whoa, 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 whoa. Right. That's Michael love. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Come on. Can we see the love? No, I people need to see that love. You got people crying, Michael. <laughs> Aww. Oh. Yeah. Oh. And I want to add something. My mom, she has taught me so well. Mm hmm. Yes. Mm hmm. Yes. So when I become, when I be, when I start to preach, and when I become a preacher as I grow up, mm -hmm. I'll know that I can do it, and. And that the spirit of God will come to me, just as she said to me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Michael. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming on, Michael. We love you. We appreciate you. Thank you for appreciating your mom. And mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yes, thank, thank you. you. God bless you. God bless you all too. Thank you all for inviting us. I hope she's thank you, mommy, for coming on. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah. Happy Mother's Day again. Happy Mother's Day yeah, again. Thank you, you all again. Yes. Thank you. All. God bless uh, you. Mm -hmm. Bye-bye. Uh, yes. So um Helena, if you are here, can you please comment? Helena Howard, Helena. Yes, this show you. Um, so I think we're going to call them. Mommy, can you please comment again? If you are here.
Mommy, if you are here, could you please comment again? Oh, she did not comment. She now can you call her? Call mommy. Okay, she's here. It's okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, Is it there? It's not there, right? Um, mommy, I was trying to call back, but it's not. It's not going through. So I'm just gonna try again. You know how you know. No, no. <coughs> she she wanna, she wanna, she wanna, I'm gonna try again later. She can move? Mm -hmm. Um, Helena, your video sign is not. Are you sure? Helena, your video sign is not there. Can you? Can you restart your phone or something, please? Okay. Yes, um, mommy, we just so now to see if Michael had any more words, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Ask him a little bit of question. Something here, Michael. Michael, come back here, please. Hold on, let me get him. Okay, mommy. Michael. Come Helena, back here, I think please. you have to turn your phone off and uh, turn it back on. Oh, why? It's not good? No, no, no. no. Not you, Mommy. Helena. Oh, okay. okay. Mm -hmm. okay. All right. All right. Okay, he's here. Come sit here. All right. Uh -huh. Okay, you want to ask him some questions, so. Uh, so we just want to know, like, what's the one thing you really admire about your mom? Mm -hmm. Uh, how successful she's become thanks to God's help. Oh, um, you so you like admire everything about her success. Like the hard yeah. work. And, and she's a good mother. Okay. Okay. And do you always like, do you wish that you could go on all the trips? Like, are you like ready someday to do, like, the kind of do what she's doing to go out there, preach, and heal? Like, is that like one of your aspirations i know that you definitely talk about preaching and you said you can't wait to be a preacher but can you just talk to us tell us uh how your mom's success um have added to your motivation uh well i've been i've been given a lot of love and I would love to travel with her to what she's for what she's doing. And it's pretty nice to get a lot of, to get to be getting a lot of love, but sometimes it's also good to be a normal kid. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. And also, that, right? Yeah. So why can't you able to travel with that? Tell her. Uh, school, 
Okay. Probably able to travel with her because of school. Yeah. Yeah, we understand that. That's kind of sucks. Um, and then also, we know, like, when your mom is home, you spend a lot of time with her. Like, you do stuff. So can you tell us more about how, like, when she's home, we want to know more about that side of her? Because we see her own life and everything, but you are in a house with her. So can you tell us, like, why she is at home? Well, she's still doing God's work at home, but she's also connecting with me, too. And, like, she could organize programs at home, or she could just, you know, converse or eat and talk with the with my, with my <laughs> grandmother. Yeah. Well, she's just spent a lot of time with me. And yeah. I do a lot of things for her that she doesn't even ask me to do. Yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Because I love her. Mm-hmm. And I know that she loves me too. We have a mutual love. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so is this one of uh, one of the longest times she's been away from you? And how has that been with you? But it's been like... Wow, if she's gonna do that, then imagine what what more she can do. Yeah, yeah, it is the longest time. So, so you know, uh, Michael, your mom also tells us on her life on the videos that during her early days when she was in the closet, it was just like it was just you and her like praying every day how did you feel about that like i don't know if you can tell us as a child like seeing your mom praying and fasting and crying and just doing those things like at first when she was doing it i was like wow this hasn't happened to her before so it must be something big so I kept wondering and pondering about it. And I was like, I was like, and then when she started praying, I was like, okay. So she's become more immersed in the spirit of God. So, yeah. And I I joined her too. But when she first did it, it was like, oh, wow, to me. I was like, wow, such a big change. Uh-huh. Yeah, because I know you was there for the party days. You used to see her yeah. party. And everything. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but usually she come home late, and I didn't get to see much of her as I do now. That's good. Mm-hmm. And so, then, so. and then, uh, you're still talking. Go ahead, Michael. I'm not. I'm done. Mm. Okay, so just one more thing, we're going to ask you, and then we're going to leave you. What? Repeat, please. The what? Repeat, please. No, I wanted to ask, Um, so her days doing, her party days and her life now, how do you see it? Uh, the big difference. Uh, well, she's moved on to a much more spiritual level and not a worldly level. <laughs> That's good. That's good. Mm-hmm. And thank you so much. So um, I know, like, some of, I don't know, you can tell us, like, some of the things you love doing with your mom, like reading the Bible. Because I know for sure, like, you have a deeper understanding of the Bible as compared to other kids. So is that, like, something you really appreciate from your mom? And do you want to say something to us about how she has helped you through reading the Bible, encouraging you? Do you want to say something like that? Yeah, she's always encouraged me to read the Bible. She said, it's always good to know more stories. Because when you're an adult, that's what she's telling me. When I'm an adult and I start preaching, 
then I'm gonna need to know stories. And I'm like, that's that's really true. So that's why I study my Bible more. Yeah. So I can gain more knowledge. And when I tell her about my Bible knowledge, she's she just feels like she just feels happy that I know all the story, like almost lots of stories, like lots of stories. Yeah. Yeah. And that's really, really good. We are so proud of you because I know um I was at your house all the time and I think you were reading a Bible or something and you really like you explain it and I think your mom even got a message from that and I was just like, Wow, this is so this is so touching. So we too just wanna say like we are really, really proud of you. Really, really proud of you being a good boy. And everything, and we can't wait to see what life has for you. We know you're gonna aspire. I mean, aspire to be like a a really good preacher. And we are all like waiting on you. And we are cheering, yeah, yeah, waiting for Michael. <laughs> so, Michael, at school, um, do you sometimes preach to your mates or something? Read the Bible to them, try to encourage them, uh, well, bring them to Christ or something. People have different religion, and that can also apply to like children at school. So, I'm I'm trying to I'm kind of subtle with the whole Bible and preaching at school, but in a way, I do it in a manner that's that's not really offending their religion or anything. I'm trying to because when I first tried to do it. There is this girl, she said, like, people have different religions. And I was like, okay, that's true. So, so yeah, I try not to offend their religions. Okay. That's good. As young as you are, you seem to have a lot of wisdom. Yep, a lot. You answer with so much courage. Yeah, well, I'm still a kid. So. <laughs> Yeah. And then we know your birthday is coming up, right? And we know your mom is not here. So do you want to tell us something about that? How do you feel about that? Like, because her birthday is in a few days, right? Saturday. Next yeah. Saturday. Next Saturday. And then you know your mom, like, if she had a will, I know she want to spend her birthday with you. But as we all know, she's out there trying to win souls. So. Do you want to tell us something about that, about how not being able to spend a birthday with you? Well, it's kind of like my, the parent that, that's that been with me is not spending my birthday with me, but she's done other times. So it's understandable. She has a job to do. So I, uh, it's okay to me, but it's like... I wish you would just come up for like a half an hour and just spend it. I mean, that's good. But you know, like she has a big surprise for you, right? And then she's going to come right after her birthday. But um, I mean, do you want to tell her that you understand that she can't be, that she cannot be here and everything? Do you want to say something about that to her? Uh, it's okay. I can wait for her to come. We're still gonna celebrate, so it be enjoyable is what matters. Yes, yes. yes. All right. Do you have any advice for the countries that she's going to, for the people that are going to attempt the programs and stuff like that? Anything you have to say to them? Well, rec well, receive your blessings now because one one day when she moves on to even even bigger audiences, you might not get a chance to you know, to, you know, get pictures with her or just get blessings because she might be in stadiums and people might be crowding her and she just wants to leave. So savor what you have with her right now, and that'll be good. Um. Also, Michael, we know there are some kids here. Like, I know we have some kids listening. So, do you want to talk to the kids? The kids, like, just say something to the kids out there that are listening. 
Well, hi, kids. And, <laughs> well, I'm about to be a preteen, so I'm still 10. But as you and I grow up, make sure you listen to your parents and listen to God. Because, yeah, you'll get really far if you do that. Okay. And don't let any other bad kids tell you to do stuff. If you see them, just walk away. Because I see a lot of bad kids in my school. And I'm like, oh, I'm not staying there. So, yeah. Mm-hmm. And then also, I know you spend a lot of time reading the Bible and um, watching super books. Is there anything from there you want to share with the kids, like maybe your favorite Bible passage mm-hmm. or favorite um, story from super book or something? Yeah. Yeah. I've been connected with super book, but there are like some gaps where I don't actually watch it sometimes, but I still watch it just to get the messages in my head. You know, like mm-hmm. season three for, for for Superbook, for me, it's been locked, so I can only watch two of the seasons now. And, well, I gotta say, there's, there's a lot of good ones. I mean, all of them are good, but still, all of them have really great messages that, that tell what God's trying to give to you uh like uh Shadrach, Meshach and Abednego. That one has a lesson to always stay faithful to God because he'll deliver you from any jaws of evil. Uh huh. All right. All right. Thank you so much, Michael. And then we're gonna leave you now because we know you wanna rest, but so you know that um this is a great place. Um, you could ask your mom for your birthday gift. Do you have something in mind? She's listening. Uh, <laughs> something big. Let's see. I've already done a good job. I want. Yeah. Okay. Maybe some special perfumes. Hello. Um, Hey, hello, man. You school, hello, man. You So that's what you should get from her. Hey, man. Okay. No, I give to her. Oh no, you give to her or oh. her? To... Oh, okay, okay, okay. Perfume too. Yeah, I get cologne. Okay, okay. Yeah, mm-hmm. okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she All gets right. perfume. I get cologne. Mm-hmm. All right. And we really like you preaching just now about the message of Shetra, Misha, and Abednego. If you do you want to share another passage? Like, do you want to tell uh, us one more message? Uh, like, Paul, you know, from Acts, that guy, who his name used to be Saul, and he didn't, he didn't believe in Jesus Christ until one day Jesus showed up when he was on the road to Damascus and then blinded him and then changed his name to Paul. And then the guy named Ananias had to pray for him and he had a change of heart. And the lesson in that one is that even when people seem like they're, they're so bad that they can't have a change in heart that they really can, that's a good message. Hmm. Now you appreciate it. Can I ask for one more? Reach on, Raven. Reach on, Michael. Okay. <laughs> I guess this is Can what we got one more to talk about. Uh, oh, oh, oh. Okay. Yeah. Uh, uh, there's this one about Esther. Yeah, she became queen. And her uncle Mordecai he believed in God and and he didn't bow down to the to the person who the king really favored, Haman. And Haman he, he got angered, so he thought of killing Mordecai and his people. And Esther she didn't well, first Mordecai didn't agree with that, then he told Esther she didn't agree with that. So then so then they came up with a plan to to get a banquet so that 
so that she could tell the king about the person who is about to do something bad to her people, which she did, and then she told Haman about it, and then he was hung to the hanging place where he where he wanted to hang Mordecai, and he died. And also his wife and and the rest of the people who followed him were thinking of killing Mordecai and the Jews. I mean, that wasn't in Superbook, but it was something I read in my Bible. Wow. Good That's so uh, awesome. The moral is to step up, and even if you think that you can't do anything, and you think your powers with the power of God, you can right wrongs and and protect anybody that you love. Mike, I'm actually just going to sit here and let you preach. You can let me know when you are done. Go okay. on. Uh, preach. Well, that's not really moral, but it's like an addition. Okay. All right. Back to preaching. Okay. <laughs> Back to preaching. Uh, there is this one with David and Goliath. Uh huh. So David, he was a shepherd, and his brothers thought he was a feeble, weak, small kid who couldn't do anything. Mm -hmm. uh, and then the Philistines they challenged the Israelites because uh, David and his brothers they were part of uh, the soldiers who fought for the Israelites and the Philistines challenged the Israelites for 40 days yeah 40 days and and David also challenged Goliath uh, and when he did they had like this and Goliath he was like like he was huge he was huge and he was and David was just like they were like a uh, like a oh okay, a little <laughs> rock compared to a to a boulder. That, that that's kind of the yeah. All right, Michael. Thank you so much. You have blessed us this morning. You have really, really blessed us. Thank you so very much. Your mom said that's good enough too. So, <laughs> yeah. We are so blessed, and we appreciate you coming here, taking your time out to come here this morning. Thank you so much, baby. We love you. Oh, you too. It was nice having you on, Michael. Thank you. All right. Bye, wow. mommy. Bye. Bye again. <laughs> Bye. How did you like my preacher, my little preacher, but his little <laughs> preacher, man? Yeah, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. it's good. It's good. All right. All right. So, bye. Yeah, yeah. Bye. 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 Thank you all. Thank you all. Thank you all. Halina, are you there? <laughs> Halina, are you there? Halina. How did everyone is, um like Michael? Wasn't that just some great lessons? I'm still on. You want to remove me? Oh. Uh, yeah, yeah. Should I? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. All right. Thank you, mommy. All right. Bye. 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 What's this? My son, Um, Helena, can, can you come in, please? If you are just joining in, we are here to um, celebrate our mommy, Evangelist Princess Balamzi, to say Happy Mother's Day. Yeah. So you can go ahead and uh, leave a comment.
telling her what happened, Molester. And what? Helena. Oh, Helena, you don't have the camera sign. Um, if you can ask somebody near you to comment, somebody that has the camera sign because you don't have it. And then while you are waiting for Helena, we all can just dance to this music, celebrating our mama. You know, you don't have the video sign. You don't have the video sign. So if you can ask somebody near you to comment, I will call them on a, any other person because you don't have the video sign. Um, thank you so much for Happy Mother's Day to you, Pastor Christabel. Happy Mother's Day, Pastor Christabel. We love you. Um, Hi, Pastor, Pastor Isaac. Pastor, will you like me to call you? Can you say something to our mother? While we wait for Elena. Oh, okay. Yes, Helena, you have a video sign now, but I'm just waiting for Pastor Isaac to respond. Or maybe we can call Helena while Pastor Isaac is getting ready. Uh, okay, uh, we can just take Helena while Pastor Isaac is getting ready because we didn't even tell him. Has he come in Okay. Pastor Isaac, do you want to say something? If we can call you on. Helena, you can come in again now. You have a video sign. Helena, come in there. Oh, she's. Oh, in a minute. You say in a minute? Okay. So should we have enough time? Yeah. Okay, okay but I said thank you. Um, just tell you now and then why but I said is here because she told him in a way. Thank you, but I said thank you so much. Helena, I'm calling you now. For all those that are just joining, um, so today is Mother Day, Mother's Day, as we all know, and we are celebrating the woman of God, Infantilist Princess Belenti, who has been a great mother to us all. So as you join in, you can just wish her Mother's Day or, and then tell her, yeah, oh my God. Helena, you just declined the call. Helena, can you comment again, please? Oh, okay, we'll say ready. I'll say ready. 
Oh, um, Pastor Isaac, you don't have a video sign. You don't have a video sign. Please, could you uh, restart? There's no video sign to your name, Pastor Isaac. Helena, the phone is ringing. Pastor Asik said it's ready. Um, I don't see Pastor Asik. Can I see Pastor Asik coming? Mm. Oh, okay, I can bring Ricky. Okay, Ricky, I'm trying. Ricky, the call is going through. I know you are with Helena. We're just trying to get here while we wait for Pastor Isaac also. is bad okay that's all i said it's coming on now we are good happy mother's day first of all to the woman of god evangelist princess for Mm -hmm. Happy Mother's Day to a wonderful woman of God who has been a blessing to me, to my family, and to many around the world. Happy Mother's Day. She's such a blessing and an occasion like this, it's an opportunity for us to celebrate a wonderful woman of God who has made herself available to many around the world. And I'm excited. I'm excited to celebrate the woman of God. Thank you, all. thank you, woman of God, so much for what you have done. You've been a blessing. You, you, you 
I love personifying. You, you love to show people around the world that you care. And that's the quality of a mother. And, uh, you know, God changed the name of Abraham to Abraham, father of many nations. And he changed the name of Sarai to Sarah, mother of many nations. And that's exactly what the woman of God is. She's a mother to so, so many people. And I celebrate her. Today is a wonderful day to celebrate the woman of God. And of course, I would love to celebrate my beloved wife, of course, Pastor Christabel. Not easy, you know. <laughs> a mother yeah. to many. Wonderful. Love our lovely kids. And you know, my mother. And of course, my, my American mom, as I call her, Dickness, Deborah Abili. An amazing, amazing mother. She's so caring. I celebrate her. And my mom, my biological mom, Mrs. Mellon Samuel, I celebrate you today. And of course, you, Wesu. Wesu <laughs> is a wonderful mother too, to her daughter. And also Janelle, because I've seen your kids too. I've Thank seen you, your family you family family family. in Liberia and your daughter, yes. of course, in America. So God bless you. All the mothers out there, I celebrate you. It's not easy. You know, I was talking to my wife this morning and I was like, you, what are you talking about? You felt pain before. He said, you, do you know what pain is? To be a mother, we feel real pain. I said, okay, it is well. So for the pain that you felt as a mother, I celebrate you. So happy Mother's Day to all the mothers. God bless you. I love you. God bless you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you. All right. We miss you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for having me. Don't worry. It's a uh, festival of fire. It's actually next week, yeah. right? Yeah. Yes. Weekend. So we're going to be there. We'll see. Yeah. Our our God bless our you. God bless you. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Bye, -bye. Network issues with Sheldon, you know. But um, let's all cheer for Thank you. Oh. Round of applause. Shows a love. Shows a love. Our pastor. Pastor Isaac. Check it. Check it. Our pastor. Check it. Okay. Thank you so much, Pastor, for coming on on such notice. We appreciate you. Always being there for our mommy in everything. We love you and everything. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much, Pastor Isaac. So, um, I think we're having issues with Helena, and she's supposed to do the presentation, but unfortunately, we are not. Getting her. Um, I know we should try to get her messenger because she is with the woman of God. So we're gonna try. Okay. Hi, Helena. Hi. Oh, we can see me like this. Nobody is me. Um. Put it up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So we are trying to get you. Do you want us to turn this off and call again? Can you see me, Clary? Yes, we see you, Clary. Awesome. Okay, All right. Um, can everybody right. online see Helena clearly? Are you guys able to see Helena? Helena, cause we actually tried to get her on a video, but it's uh, not going through. So oh. Let's see, let's see her clearly. Can can I do that's why I'm trying to do? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. So Helena, are you with the woman of God now? Yeah, I'm about to go to her room. Okay, so I'm just going to wait and see and tell her Happy Mother's Day. Um, Who are you with? Can we see if you are, are you with the other ladies? Yeah, I saw I am with my co-worker, Ricky. Can I say hi? 
Hi, Hi Reiki. Reiki. <laughs> Hi. Uh, my sister's Joyce, she is from Ireland here. She's been helping. Hi. Hi. Mr. Joyce. And I'm with, and I'm with one of the followers too. She came along for the Ireland program. Hi. Hello. Hi. And I'm also with Sis Kit. She's a long time follower of Umar and she is here also too. Hi. Hi. Sweet. I want to get into See what happens. Okay. Um, Helena, you know, let's just try one more time. See if we can get you. Okay. If we can, and we're gonna okay. um call you back on Messenger. So okay. you can go off and comment. Yeah, and then we'll try again okay. to get you. Okay. All right. All right. Thank you. So we are just gonna wait for. Helena, you know the comments. Hopefully, it goes through. Okay, Helena, you say you're ready. I'm gonna call you now. Oh, decline. Okay, Helena, could you please ask Kate to comment? Maybe she will. If you can ask Kate if she has like her own network, she's not connecting to the hotel network. Maybe, maybe it's going to be better. Or somebody else that have a better network. Sis Rejoice or somebody. What is that? Okay. Okay. That should try. Okay. Is this um low? Low dead Um Kate, I'm trying to get you but it's not Korean. Somebody say try yeah. Um no, you no longer have a video sign. You know, Kate, you no longer have the video sign. Can somebody else try? You want that? Okay. It's not there. See? Where's the video sign? You want to call on my phone? Um, can Sis rejoice? Or somebody comment. Okay, so if there's no one, we're just gonna go ahead and call on messenger. Okay, Helena, so we're just gonna call your messenger and then we're just gonna to work from there. We are so sorry for the network issue. Okay. Uh, we're the speaker. So, 
We're gonna get you, you ladies. Um, Sorry. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we all are commenting on the video. The internet here is so bad. We, you can't get us online. Everyone is commenting. All right, that should. Can you can you just um speak louder because they said you were kind of low. Yeah. Okay. So are you a film of God now? Yeah, sure. Okay. Okay, can you just make sure you are very loud? Yes. <laughs> All right, let me even make it even louder than that. Yeah, yeah, make it the loudest. Mm -hmm. Can everybody hear Alina okay. online? Yeah. They okay? Yes, you can keep going. So beautiful now so pretty natural beauty yes Chai. mommy looks so pretty helena can we see our mommy <laughs> Celebrate you, mommy. God bless you, ladies. I've been watching on Facebook. I'm watching you guys. God bless you, ladies. Amen. Happy birthday. Can you guys see?
Yes. because we heard um, the woman of God say she want to come live. So as you comment, I'm going to get just a few people. 
and we're just gonna talk for 30 seconds to a minute please don't go over it just to tell her happy birthday so i hope you ladies are ready i'm gonna bring some people on camera now if you have the video so i'm not seeing her commenting it's pastor krista bell I don't see her commenting. So, so fast, I'm trying to get you on camera. I'm just waiting for oh so cat is fine I'm gonna get somebody else yeah she she could comment okay If you wanna be, if you wanna come on, you can just comment, and we'll call you. So far, it's not going through. I've tried talkers, and now I'm trying infantilist Victoria Hook, and it's not going through. I'm gonna turn it. Hi, everybody. I'm good. Wow, woman of God. I would like to say happy, 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 big. Mother's Day, I thank you for all that you are doing and I appreciate you so much. I thank you for your love and care and I thank you. Thank you so much for accepting the call of God upon your life because of you saying yes and not saying no. You have blessed us. God has used you to bless us so much because of you are more closer to God than ever before. Thank you so much and I love you so much and oh my my gosh, you came to Australia. We didn't want you to go back. We wish we can just follow you back to America and just follow you everywhere. Thank you so much that, you know, everyone that comes into contact with you is never the same again. So thank you so much. You are really, really a true, 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 true daughter of the Most High God. I thank you so much, and I thank you for your love, and I love you. Happy Mother's Day. Love you. Ah! Thank you, Dr. <laughs> uh, I, I have a question for you. You are one of the people that has been fortunate enough to work closely with the woman of God during her stay yeah. in life. Can you, like, in 30 seconds or one minute, tell us, like, how it felt working close with her? Like, it um, tell us about, like, the motherly stuff she did or just about your time with her, how you felt like a mother. How she, yeah. how you look at her like, her like a mother to you. Yeah. Woman of God is so caring from the one it's like most of the time she even forgets about herself and she starts to care about the people that are around her. Like her love, he, she will give you like a criticism, right? Criticism. <laughs> but, you know, like, but it's good. You know how sometimes they said that you have to be cool to be kind. But her sure. own is like...
our own betterment. You understand? So working close with the woman of God is that you would think that, you know, she'll be so like, pamperers and all of that but she's so humble she's so down to earth and working with her with such like a big you know privilege and i love her so much she cares you know she'll be like oh dokas you know they sleep like i'll come <laughs> home and you know i'll, I'll like i'll hardly say because you know i don't want to miss going to go and meet her i'll just lay down and then before you know it i'll get i was like woman of god i'm ready i'm ready when you are and she'll be like, you know, the sleep is supposed to sleep. You know what I mean? That's how, like, excited and um, fun and relaxing it was to, you know, work with the woman of God. And, you know, it has really, really, she has really, really, really changed my life. And, you know, I just want to say thank you. And I love you. And the kids love you. And the miss you so much. And she cares so much about my kids as well, you know, that, you know, she was, you know, giving me advice about the kids and, you know, all of that. And the kids love her so much. If they were awake now, they would have said happy birthday, but they already sleep. You know, happy birthday, happy, happy Mother's Day, <laughs> but they're already sleeping. So thank you so much. And, yeah, I love you. Thank you. All right, thank you so much, Takas. Thank you. Uh, we are going to take a few more people and then we are going to leave. Um, Miss Katina. Don't have the video sign. Sign on, sentence. I'm trying to get you. Hope it goes through. Um. Um, Diana, in any culture, I'm going to try again, and I'm going to keep trying. If have something to say, you can just comment, and I will invite you. Um, you can try yourself. Okay, what's going on here? Uh, can you see me, Whistle? I don't know what's going on. Yes, that's me. Hi. Mm -hmm. We can see you. We can see you okay. Hello. Hi, everybody. Hi. Hi. I just want to take this opportunity to wish the woman of God a happy, happy Mother's Day. I remember October 2017, my life took a different turn when I encountered her video on Facebook. And through her videos, I've learned to pray. I've learned to speak in tongues like never before. I have learned to be a better mother, a better wife, a better friend. Through her, I've learned to love God because this is something I could not really accept the love of God as a father. And when I saw how much she loved God, it really pushed me and drive me to want to be closer to God and have a better relationship. So I just want to take this opportunity to thank her so very much. It's been a blessing for her to be a part of my life. I have seen what she does for others and that in itself have drive me to be a better person, to help out other people in their time of need. I just want to say, God bless you, woman of God. You have been a tremendous inspiration to me and to those around you. And um, I thank you through your ministry. I have encountered some amazing young ladies 
who pray and through them, having them around me, it has really strengthened my relationship with God. Thank you and God bless you. I love you so much. We Sue and Janelle, I want to wish both of you a happy Mother's Day. And to our, our grandmother, Deaconess Deborah Abili, God bless you. And thank you so much for bringing these fruits, who is producing so much more fruits. And God bless you so much on uh, our behalf. God bless you all. I love everybody. Happy Mother's Day to all the ladies on this platform. God bless you all. Have a nice day. Happy Mother's Day. Happy Mother's Day, Diana. Thank you. Bye. Bye. So, if you want me to call you, can you just comment? Are you perfecting? Susan, you don't have the video sign. Priscilla, you don't have the video sign. Josephine, your phone should be ringing. Um, okay, I'm gonna try to call Josephine back because it's not going. Let me go, Princess. Okay. Ellen, you don't have the video sign. I'm trying to get you, Princess. More cool. If you are just joining in, we are here to celebrate our woman of God, Princess Evangelist Vision Valenti, to say happy mother. So you can just um, comment it out. Angelis Victoria Hope, we try calling you, but it's not going to.
So, Princess Nitubi, I'm trying to get you. Hello. Hi. Sorry, I'm driving. Happy Mother's Day, Evangelist Princess Belema Abili. You know, I love you. And you have been a mother to so many. I remember when you started and people started calling you mommy, mommy. You were like, don't call me mommy. That makes me look so old. I only have one child and that's my kid. That's the only one to call me mommy. And I remember our girl will not stop. But today you have accepted that. And you're not just being a mother to Michael, you've been a mother to so many, the young, the old, the elderly. And I just bless God for you because God is taking you so high and you, has, you haven't even gotten to the place where God is taking you to. You're going higher and higher. I just see you floating. Just, I mean, your, your legs are not even touching the floor. And I just bless you. I bless God for you because, because of you answering this call, I'm able to really, really love God. I'm able to be really, really afraid of sin. I used to go to church, but it was so easy for me to sing. But right. it really made me know the love of God and to be to stay away from sin. I just love you and I wish you a happy Mother's Day. Thank you so much. Thank you, Princess Netube. Yeah. Okay,